Hey guys, what is going on? So I installed iOS 11.2.5 beta 4 on my iPhone 6, but this isn't even iPhone 6. This is just a quick like little update about what this update is basically about. And oh my God, dude, there's a deer outside. Hold on. Okay, I don't know if you can see the deer or not, but it's like right there somewhere like right here i don't even know oh it's moving right now okay yeah you got you guys see it and i do just want to quickly state that if the audio for this video sucked I i'm completely sorry this road mic i have now is completely like messing up so i need to like contact them and sue them hopefully for a messed up mic <laughs> I'm just kidding. So, and of course, you know, I say this every time, please enter my Xbox One giveaway. I'm giving away my personal Xbox One. In order to enter, you just have to subscribe to the channel and add me on all the social networks. All the links are in the description. Now with this update, I, I really don't want to say they didn't do anything because they fixed the little problem of these or the stock sounds. Some people were having problems where basically the whole entire OS was just extremely, extremely loud. Uh, whether you clicked on the keyboard or you were calling somebody in the dial tones or whatever, um, all those things were super loud but fortunately they fixed that that's not a problem anymore but uh, I actually took a benchmark right now hold on let me see where photos are and this is the first time I actually did a benchmark so here it is this is for 11.2.5 I think this was beta 2 um, I did not do one for beta 3 and so you get a 75026 uh, I guess as the overall score I still don't even know how this works out but afterwards uh, this beta I just ran one and I get a 75305 so it's definitely a little bit of an improvement so that's super cool this is an Antutu benchmark I don't know if it's different with the Geekbench but yeah so that's basically that one I'm kind of glad that it's actually going up I do notice a little bit more snappiness I'm not gonna lie I mean compared to my iPhone 7 plus that I have it's nowhere near it but it's actually a little bit snappy I don't know if it's just because of like me just noticing it but yeah but overall this update was pretty small it was just like 136 megabytes i think something like that so other than that there weren't really too many other features uh some other features were some siri add-ons um you can ask them for news hey siri uh can we go on a date Alright, so Siri's trying to hit on me, but basically what's going on is you can ask Siri for like different news podcasts, um, CNN, Fox News, NPR, and I think another one, I don't even remember the other name, but that's just an 11.25 overall update, so that's super cool. And other than that, they really didn't do much else. I really wish they did, you know. I'm still waiting for the battery details, and I'm still waiting for, you know, some more toggles in the control center. I'm sick and tired of just waiting for it. Hopefully Apple does add more features, you know. People are still having problems with iMessages not coming up in sync, so hopefully Apple fixes all those, guys. But other than than that that's pretty much it hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you guys did please hit the like button and comment down if you guys have any questions or anything i'll be happy to answer if i get the time to but more importantly than everything else i love every single one of you guys and hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then